Northwestern is a spectacular research university. It's an amazing honor for me to, especially trying to build on the great works of somebody I admire tremendously, Henry Bienen. Also, you can't spend 20 out of 30 years as a faculty member at a place like Williams and not be obsessed with the quality of undergraduate education. The challenge, of course, is in the context of a great research university like Northwestern, how do you make sure that you maintain the quality of the undergraduate experience while at the same time nurturing everything else that happens at this remarkable university. So I'm gonna spend a lot of time on that. I love undergraduate students, I can't wait. I'm having dinner at one of the dorms tonight. I'm sure that's gonna be a, a great culinary experience. Uh, students, you know, ever, ever eat in a dorm? It is disgusting, not the food, but the students eat in about three minutes. I'm still placing my napkin and they're gone. So I can meet with many groups of students one after another and still be working on my salad, but there's nothing like the students for me. That's why I went into academe. I mean, I love my research, uh, but I particularly love my undergraduate teaching. And I'm going to do it here, just as Henry has, as well as graduate teaching. And, and I hope to be as involved uh, you know, with the undergrads as they would let me be. You know, when you look at this class size, when you look at the clever interdisciplinary programs, when you look at how the 11 different schools, the six of them undergrad, you know, how they all interrelate, when you look at the research opportunities, the performance opportunities, you know, for the undergrads, it is remarkable. It's great to be back in an environment with PhD students and a range of master's students. Uh, I know how great the professional schools are at the graduate level, because many of my top Williams students uh, are there now. I have a whole bunch at Kellogg. I have a whole bunch at the medical school, the law school, and on and on. And, you know, I, I hope I can, can contribute to that. I'm an economist, and I work on the economics of higher education. It's important to reach out to uh, disadvantaged groups even more actively than any of us have done. We're supposed to be engines of mobility. We're supposed to be a meritocracy. We're supposed to recognize hidden talents, and especially the most elite, the most heavily resourced institutions, the most prestigious institutions are supposed to be agents of mobility. If there's a sweet spot for me, you know, that's it, access and affordability. In addition to the strength of the athlete, of an athlete, you also, the president has to have the wisdom of Solomon, the cunning of Machiavelli, the courage of a lion, and the stomach of a goat. This gets back to eating in the dorms today. Uh, I, I, I have the stomach, and I hope to prove to you I have the rest as well. So thank you.